everybody, welcome back to E Cubed. Today's expression is another interesting word. It's an adjective. Token. T O K E N. A token something. A token something. Hmm. So, in this case, the word token means typical, stereotypical. A token. Oxford teacher. If you think about Oxford University or Harvard University, what is your image of the professor? Is he wearing blue jeans? Probably not. He's probably wearing an old suit. Maybe tweed. T-W-E-E-D. He probably has a mustache or a beard, maybe even some long hair. Not too long, but a little bit long. He speaks a little bit slowly, very intelligent, and rather boring. He prefers reading to teaching. Research is his perfect area. So if you see someone like this guy, yeah, he's a token professor. He's a token Oxford professor or a token Harvard professor. He's a typical professor. He's a stereotypical professor. Now, we have to be careful because we can use this expression to describe other people from other countries. And sometimes these stereotypes are not very nice. So, let's check out the dialogue first and then I have an assignment for you. That guy is really fat. And look at him eating that hot dog. He's a token American. We really need to change our diet. Yeah, a token American. The token American diet. Hamburgers, french fries, and Coca-Cola. Token, token American, a little bit fat, or maybe very fat. Yeah, not every American, of course not. But that would be the token American meal, or the token American. It's true. Not all, but in general. It's a stereotype. So, what about in your country? Let's say you live in France. What is the token Frenchman? Or if you live in China, what is the token Chinese person, man, woman, whatever? What is this token image, this stereotype of a person in your country? Do not talk about people in other countries because that's dangerous, okay? It's nice, it's fun, it's easy to talk about your country and your country's people, but it's not nice sometimes. Eh, it could be uh, when you talk about somebody else from another country, okay? So I want you to think about it. Think about your country and what is the token countryman. Now we can talk about jobs, that's pretty easy. The token politician is a liar. The token lawyer is a liar. The token businessman is greedy. The token cook is French. Wears a little white hat. I don't know, I don't know. So we can talk about jobs, that's easy. But your assignment is to describe the token Irishman, if you're from Ireland, or the token German, if you're from Germany, the token Russian, if you're from Russia. And you can have it as the token Russian man or the token Russian woman, the token Korean man, the token Korean woman, the token 40-year-old Korean man. Be specific and you should be able to find a pretty good image. Okay? That's your assignment. Good luck. And remember, be careful when you use this expression, especially about people from another country or another area, because it's a stereotype and some people will get pretty angry. Okay? So, so be careful and no fighting down below. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.
That guy is really fat. And look at him eating that hot dog. He's a token American. We really need to change our diet. That guy is really fat. And look at him eating that hot dog. He's a token American. We really need to change our diet. That guy is really fat. And look at him eating that hot dog. He's a token American. We really need to change our diet.